again to the six, and again it's headed out by Wisconsin. This time, Adler will keep it in. Shot goes off the defender and in. And Brian Ackley will get credit for the goal. It's 1-0 Hoosiers. Nichols go from distance and forces Kane to make the save and put it over the crossbar. You are not normally going to score from there, or I don't even think you will, but that one was much more dangerous than it looked at first. Let's go to try to find them on the corner. Better strategy. Curled into the six, and again, Kane just shrugs off the minor nick. Shot in front, and that'll go in. And the Badgers have tied it with 5-10 to go in the first half. Indiana will try again. Here's Alexander, just came back into the match. Danny Kelly left. There's a shot ripped it into the net. Neil Wilmar. We want to talk about man of the match. How about having an assist and a goal? The goal breaks a 1-1 tie. Indiana leads it 2-1. And now Wisconsin, which answered back within four minutes last time, will try to do it again. And they do! Wisconsin has scored to tie it. We've got a terrific game here in Bloomington. It's Taylor Waspy with the goal off the header. Drops to Lee Hagedorn's feet. Wilmarth again, edge of the area. Chips it across, Bruin is at the six, and it's put home by Eric Alexander to win the game. A beautiful cross, a beautiful goal, and in a game that has seen five goals and a lightning delay of over an hour, it's Eric Alexander who takes the victory lap. What a performance by Wisconsin, though. Ultimately, Indiana wins it.